ladies and gentlemen, and as always, thank you for watching. Uh, this morning we've been called by a customer that uh, uh, has a driver. It was very, very foggy this morning and cold. Uh, we had some uh, a heavy frost. Uh, it's, the sun's come up and most of it's melted off now, but uh, apparently the driver couldn't see very well, got off in an exit and pulled off a little too far uh, onto the soft shoulder and it's just spinning his wheels at this point. Uh, just needs a little help getting back up onto the hard shoulder. Uh, no injuries, nothing like that. So that's always the best case. Anyway, here we go. All right, this should be us. Should be our exit right here. Super singles. Okay. Gotcha. Not that big of a deal. I just, they put uh, fresh soft on here. Fresh soft gravel, it looks like. It was super singles. He's stuck. Sir, I used to haul this man. I never would have thought when I pulled off on here to take a power nap. And super singles, probably what got you that. And looks like it's two inch minus. Yeah, I had power dividers locked in trying to go back and forth. And when it's super, dug, are you are empty, right? Oh, yes, super singles, no weight. Still, you would have thought this had been hard packed enough. I pulled over on this shoulder, I don't know how many times. I picked up trucks and trailers here, and... Uh, well, this is fresh. Yeah. This wasn't here last yep. week. Yeah, but you couldn't see it because it was dark and it was foggy. Well, it wasn't dark. Well, it was it was foggy though, wasn't it? No. No? I left Cape down here empty. I had the bread on and unloaded. Okay, yeah. I left Cape at uh, 6.30. This morning? Yeah. Oh, it was foggy where I was at but that was around the river and around the diversion yeah. channel oh, I had I had a fog when I come through there yeah. and unload at four o'clock this morning oh yeah I'm sure all right international Do what, sir? You can see where they rolled it. It's it's packing. It does feel underfoot. It feels good. I mean, just one of those things. Yeah. Uh oh. I got 
gotta go to Maryland Heights. Oh. So I'm not even gonna Yeah, you won't have enough hours to get there now, will you? Right. Oh, excuse me. Let me grab this line here. I set up here at uh, Highway 67 <sighs> CC on the way down last night for a three-car crash. Oh, really? Cable had just a small snag in it, I guess. Didn't want to come out for me. They'll get wrapped up sometimes. Yeah, when I was growing up, my dad was on a four-hour call with AAA for the service station he oh. worked with. Oh no. <laughs> I know a little bit about it. Pull when you take off? No, sir. I just want you to steer it this way. Okay. I'm not going to take off. I'm just going to winch you up. Right here on this uh, exit ramp, I don't trust people driving. I'd rather just come out nice and smooth and easy. and see if you can come up out of there. I think you're good now, but I'll pull forward, give you enough room to get out here. slowed way down. Very nice. And he's walking right up out of there. Good deal. Alright, I'll get the numbers off of it. We'll be good to go. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. I'm headed back to the shop. He is safely on the interstate. I made sure that he uh, made it over the ramp and onto the uh, interstate. He is good to go. Get over here safely. He's good to go. 
No damage, no injuries. Simple pull out. So, uh, anyway, on to the next one. As always, thank you for watching, and God bless.